to me, there's nothing better than finding the right horse for the right person. And, uh, Good morning, it's been crazy around here lately. We've had some crazy winter weather and it's not just around here, but all around the country. But about two nights ago, the wind was going crazy. Gusts up to 80 miles an hour and consistently blowing about 55 miles an hour throughout the night. Blew in a winter storm and the freeway between Ash Fork, Arizona and Gallup, New Mexico. So probably a 200 mile, 300, what is that? Probably 250 mile stretch has been closed down. So semi trucks cannot get through and anyway it's been crazy and the freeway still closed even though this morning's a pretty pretty nice day around here the freeway still closed and vicky's needing to get on the road because casey's birthday present was to get to go to houston to a high jump camp and vicky and casey are supposed to fly out tomorrow morning so Pray that the freeway opens. We, we've we heard it might open here soon, this morning. So anyway, so Blake and I are gonna throw some feed and then I'm excited to share with you an idea we had for one of these horses we got from Flagstaff, from Donna and Ted. Super excited and uh, it's, regarding one of the beautiful Arabians we got from them. So anyway, Blake's throwing some hay. I got to capture this on film. He's working, guys. He's working. I got to uh, show you. You Just... guys always. Wait, what did you say, Blake? Said they always see me working when I'm with you. They're always <laughs> supervising. That's true. I'm the supervisor. Good morning, horses. There's Cassie and Candy and Duchess and Lily and Chipper and Jet and Eho. So, hey, you, do you mind uh, driving forward and I'll just toss it out as you drive? Um, not if you're standing up there. I don't want to kill you. I don't, I'll, I'll get down. Actually. I know you're gonna make fun of me, but I've got to, it, it's nice for me to video while you, while you do it. It's hard to video while I drive. That's very true. So, when we plant this field, we won't have this luxury of being able to drive down the side here and throw feed. But who's gonna have their baby first? Lily here or Lex back in the back? They were both exposed to the stallion about the same time. So I'm excited to see we're about a month away from having a baby here on the farm. But anyway, it's a beautiful morning this morning. The winds are supposed to pick up again though. And uh, this winter weather has just been nuts. Um, Blake, let's throw out a little bit more. Let's open a bell and, and go forward and just a little bit more would be great. Thank you, bud. Am I supervising good? What? Am I supervising good? Oh, yeah. Good. I want to make sure I'm doing my job all right. Yep, I know what I'm supposed to be doing before I'm even done with the first job. <laughs> yeah, I just keep you working all the time. Okay, so we've been watching for the freeway to open, and uh, I heard something, but it's a train. The oh, train. A is there a semi coming? Yeah, and a little car. So we've seen a few little cars this morning and semis, so oh there's a semi truck. There's a car. This is awesome. 
I know to you that may not seem exciting. Awesome. They open up the freeway, I gotta go to school. That's true. Blake's on a two hour delay. Yesterday I couldn't go anywhere to go. I, I supervise seminary classes for the Church of Jesus Christ of Latter-day Saints and I couldn't go anywhere because the freeways were closed everywhere. This morning we're on a delay, but if once the freeway opens up, hopefully we can get going. Man, with this sun coming out, this is beautiful. What are you doing? Everyone's like, man, is Blake not working or what? Yeah. Well, I got my zipper jammed. Oh. <laughs> I just pulled out my knife from there. Yeah, maybe throw a little bit more feed and then... Hopefully you've enjoyed coming along this morning, guys. As you see, our beautiful horses. That's Lily right here, and it's either her or Lex that'll have the first baby. Chipper won't have hers till probably August. But uh, hope you've enjoyed coming along. And now, let me show you the idea we had with Casanova. That's his registered name that they call Tiger. So let's see how how that went and what my idea was. Hey friends, I've got an idea. My good friend Jerome was on the ride, the Pony Express ride with us, and he loves Arabians. And he's one of the best horsemen I know. He can ride anything and not many people would want to train an older horse that's never been trained before. But Jerome, is ready for the challenge and I think I'm going to give him a chance to get Tiger. <laughs> he had just about caught him and Tiger decided to run off for a minute. But... So Tiger is one of them that I got from Donna and Ted. He's the gilding that it has never been ridden. And at his age, to start riding him would be intimidating for most people, but Jerome knows his horses, loves his horses, and is so good with what he does. So Today is such a nice day. It started out about 25 degrees, but now it's probably 60 degrees, and the wind's been calm, and the sun's out, so it's super nice. But Jerome is the one that, if you watched any of our shorts or reels or whatever, you may have seen Jerome. He got the fastest mile on the Pony Express, and he also um, was the one that was doing the Zorro move, <laughs> kind of riding his horse. A lot of people are like, that's not wise to let a horse rear up. Well, it was all trained. It was not something he was letting the horse do to misbehave. But Tiger normally lets us go right up to him, but he's filling his oats and giving us a show here. But he'll come. Yeah. <laughs> So Jerome's going to catch him and he kind of wants to see what he'll do, putting the saddle on his back. Because he's so gentle, it'll be interesting. So Jerome and I are going to maybe work a deal. I know Jerome can make Tiger something special. And so he's going to try him out and we're going to see if it's a good fit. But look at him, picking up all his feet, messing with him. So I think this might be the perfect fit. So Jerome already has him over here and brushed him off. and putting pads on him just to kind of see how he'll react. 
Donna and Ted have loved and taken care of their horses so well and he's had his hooves done every six weeks I think they said and so he's had lots of human contact a lot of love he just hadn't been ridden but look he's he's not really flinching at much is he Jerome Hey, how are you, Jesse? They loved it when you videoed one time. Do you want a video for a while? He doesn't seem to mind at all, does he? Okay, Jesse, this is Jesse. This is Jerome's little brother, and he is awesome. He's one of our best video there. So you go ahead and video, and you can talk about what they're doing. Okay. And, and uh, you can stop every once in a while and then start it again. I've got to meet someone at the house real quick. Okay. okay. I'll put this on the front seat. Your home of your car. Right. He's doing pretty good, huh, Drew? Is it he or she? He's a boy gelding. Uh. Oh. No branding? So, Drum had got the saddle on the horse. Doing pretty good. Drum, how good is he doing with the saddle on? He did pretty good when you put the saddle on, huh? A little. Well, my phone went dead while Jesse was videoing and we have so many projects going on today. The power company said our trees are growing into the power lines, so they're cutting those down and uh, working on our irrigation system. Anyway, life's pretty crazy right now, but as you saw, they were working with Tiger and I come down and Jerome's riding him. First day to ever be ridden and now they're gonna go to, for a ride as a family. So Jerome and Jarrell and Jesse. So let me show you. This is not how most people would do it. But <laughs> most people aren't Jerome. Jerome uh, saddles him up 
and he's doing good and he gets on and uh anyway pretty crazy how's he doing i'm fine so you're gonna take gonna him go for a ride huh yep. where are you gonna put jesse he's riding this one. Oh, cool so you're gonna ride tiger right now oh yeah i'm gonna switch saddles on it though okay i'm gonna put this one on there if that would help you cool Yeah, these boys could ride a zebra if, if we had one around here, but, but Tiger's done super good as they work with them. I, when I was done, I had to meet someone that was bringing some wood chips from all the trees that they're cutting down. I asked them if they'd bring them over to the house and I had to meet them up at the house. And when I came back down, the phone had gone dead and we missed a lot of Jerome working with Tiger. But he's like, hey, we're ready to go for a ride. So he brought his brothers over here with the other horses. And, and here you go. Give it a try, buddy. Come here. All right, what are you All right you guys have fun. These boys are amazing. All right, Alan. See you later. How did the ride go? It was good. Did it? Yeah, all he did was train, waiting for the train to come, and let it go by. He got little stuff when I was on him, but he was all right. Well, for a first ride, oh my gosh, this is amazing. I thought, I thought it was going to go. So, what do you think, Jerome? Are you and Tiger going to get along good? I love this one already. <laughs> That's awesome. Once I knew the Arabian, I already fell in love with it. <laughs> well, super excited that Jerome's going to have this horse. And I think you ought to get him ready to go on that Pony Express ride next year. Oh, he'll be more than ready by the time around. <laughs> that is so cool. Well, look at Tiger. Would you believe the first ride ever went well and Jerome's in love and this is going to be an awesome fit. So to me, there's nothing better than finding the right horse for the right person. And uh, Jerome is going to be the perfect owner for this horse. And to think that he had never been trained to ride, but he's been loved on his whole life. And now, now he's gonna be useful as well as loved. Oh, yeah. Well, Jerome, I can't thank you enough. I can't thank you enough, Alan. I really appreciate you thinking about me before yeah. anybody else. Well, I'm glad I thought of you before anyone else too, so. Well, he's a nice horse, I love him. He is awesome, isn't he? Wasn't that amazing? Casanova here, or Tiger, did amazing. And I'm so glad I had the idea to let Jerome have that opportunity because he loves this horse. And he saddled him up, checked him out, lunged him, and he was doing so good. Jerome jumped on and he's ridden him for the past two or three days. We're finally getting this edited, but we'll show you some updates as we go along. But anyway, tell me what you think. But right here, Casanova or Tiger has found a new home with Jerome. <laughs> Have a great day.